in this video we are back again playing a new update to find the fridges in the party hat event so one new fridge has been added of igloo so igloo is um, in the snow mountain area and there we go and we can see it saying on the side of snow wedge mountain so nice and easy you can see it hanging off a branch there if I can ask if you do enjoy this video or any other from Judgment TV, if you can please help to support me by subscribing to my channel, dropping me a like and leaving me a comment. Thank you so, so much. So don't hate me. This is going to be a how-to to show you guys how to get this. I haven't got the two new party hat fridges yet. There's always a bit of pressure when I know I've got to get a video out and it's around my skills and my hobby skills so I'm showing you how to in this video and then the pressure's off me I can then just carry on and try and get these party hats in my own time. So go into Fridge Donald's into the cave and we need to go speak to Paranormal Fridge. This is in order to get the Ghost Burger. And if I can ask if yes I know for all of you how dead easy it is to get these uh, party hats and obby is I'm really really happy that it is easy for you but please don't hate me in the comments and kind of say oh it's already easy for me <laughs> well done if you get these no problem but obviously for me on an iPad the obbies that I have to do in this I do struggle with so by eating the ghost burger we can see the buttons appearing so I am going to take you round and show you the locations of all the 10 buttons. I did get 9 out of 10 so it's really frustrating that I didn't get the last one but you know where it is, you know I haven't got possessed fridge yet and guess which obby it was in. So starting off easy underneath the chandelier we can press to get the first of our 10 buttons. Making our way into the library area now. And just a word of, to the wise with this, this didn't work. So I couldn't click the button if I had the ghost burger activated. So I had to eat the burger, take the burger off, click the button. Um, I don't know if it's any different for anybody else, but that was just something that I had to do on my iPad, which was really infuriating for me. So the next button I found is up in the attic. So this is where you have like the psycho killer's phone and the keypad. Going into the vampire's room and there is a button behind their coffin. And the buttons are on a timer so you are going to have to get to them before they disappear. They have to be visible for you to click them. Into the ghost obby and the next one that I found is just on the back of the platform here. To get to Possessed again, click the orb, go back outside to the stairs and you can see the platforms making our way up to the attic area. And this is Possessed's obby, um, of which I haven't done yet. And look, I knew it, I knew there would be one in this obby and it wasn't going to be as easy as putting it on the platform, is it? And I admit, I haven't got a possessed fridge, I haven't done this obby yet, I hate it. I hate it with a passion. So trying to get on the end of the ledge and running backwards worked for me. Um, but did you not see what I saw then? Am I going crazy? Is this game trying to infuriate me to throw my iPad at the wall? Literally, I got there, the button was pressed. I could see it, I was pressing the screen on the button. Did it give me the paranormal button? No, no it did not. 
So I tried again. Eat the burger, there's the button pressing the bloody screen. Is it giving me that bloody button? No, no it's not again. This game hates me. This obby hates me. So I did find that I could actually stand on the orb. Um, you can make the jump um, if you if you good enough. <laughs> it does just give you a bit of a relaxed time just between the countdowns. And again, at the burger, put it away. Click in the button. Click in the button. Click click click. And again, nothing. And the platform goes. I got to the point where literally my iPad was going to be destroyed. Again, did it again. Click, 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 nothing. And of course, because the platform's moving, I end up getting thrown off. If they expect me to flip my view as well, if that is underneath the platform, you have got zero chance of me getting this party hat. Sorry, it's never gonna happen. <laughs> I admit I suck, so. The next button we find is in with bat and it's on the back of the um, the bat itself. Back into the ghost obby. When you've searched the house you know and you're still outstanding some buttons you know that there's going to be one at the end of an obby or one of the games that you need to do. So going back down the ghost obby. Luckily there's a checkpoint here and again we've got a button right in the middle so loving it although at least the platforms don't move on this ghost obby and this is where it's really annoying for me to have eat the burger and then sort of click it off and then click the button the next one is on the back of the table leg in the library and then finally we just need to make our way back up to the attic and the last two we're going to get from this area So remember at the start I showed you one um, up by shadow. So again we're going to have to get the orb here. It may help to have your Bloxy Cola refill just to be a bit quicker if you need it. But there we go, take the burger off and we've got that one. And then again back up to the attic and we need to go actually inside of what I call the Psycho Killer. So we're going to call them, answer the phone call and then the button is in the corner there so just be mindful obviously if Psycho does end up touching you you're gonna die. <laughs> On to Bunny, so again yes I know I haven't got this one either but I did try so many different things to try and figure out this clue so I was like oh you know it's a basic party hat and they get so many carrots they turned into the bunny. So tried being a basic hat and then trying to tap carrot in the shop. That didn't work. So then I dressed as a carrot and went back for a carrot reunion. That didn't work. And then I saw the snowman. And obviously what does a snowman have for its nose? A carrot. So dressing as a carrot, I'm gonna go see the snowman in Snow Mountain. Which would sort of also explain why Igloo is now here as well. It's sort of a hint to go back here really, isn't it? <laughs> so making our way back to the Snow Hotel. And then we're going to go up to the top floor, so number five. Make 
making our way up the truss uh, so we can go out the top of the hat. This is obviously so us dressed as the character can meet the carrot nose and have a reunion. Once we're here, we are then presented with this. And oh, I don't like the burgers, I suck at them, but luckily, so for the red and the blue, um, unlike I've had to do before, you don't have to click on them, you just have to aim yourself and land on them. So much like if you've done the rubber duck obby, this is very, very similar. So just landing on each of the burgers. And yes, I know that you will probably find this super, super easy, but when I'm trying to hold an iPad, obviously move the direction with my one thumb and then the view and click with my other one. It gets a bit complicated. I need, a, I need more hands to do this. And there's no checkpoint, which absolutely sucks for me as well. I really could have used one at the end of this particular section before we hit the ones that are grey. So lured into a false sense of security that I don't have to click burgers. Obviously I've jumped completely unprepared that the grey ones I have to click to bounce. So super happy for you if you find this easy. You have no problems getting bunny party hat but I'm just going to have to do this in my own time with no pressure of trying to get a video out before obviously the party hat event's over. <laughs> But there we have it, thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you real soon for the next update. Bye!